all right uh, we were discussing about the dictionary methods so continuing the same concept uh, today our method is copy method of dictionary when we are using the copy method it creates the shallow copy of dictionary shallow copy means that copy of only keys is created not of values there are two type of copies shallow copy and deep copy shallow copy means that uh, copy of outer layer upper layer is created that is only the keys is created not of values but deep copy says copy of keys as well as the values is created we are to deal with the shallow copy okay now how to uh, uh, which method uh, is used to create the shallow copy of the dictionary the copy method okay but in copy method there are so many variations there are some variations in the copy method okay so let us discuss one by one i have one dictionary s i have roll number 1 i have name anuj i have marks 90 i have grade a i have city dedi oh sorry okay so this is my dictionary s and uh, i created the copy of the dictionary t is the copy by using the copy method the name of the dictionary dot copy method and it will create the copy of the dictionary and assign the copy to a new variable t t is the second copy or the duplicate copy of s print t same result will be produced if you print s again the same result okay have you noticed yes all right now there are some variations let me tell you those variations now listen carefully if i am creating the copy of dictionary using assignment operator like i say r equal to s i have created a copy of dictionary s r r is the copy of dictionary s and i created this copy by using the assignment operator i am not using the copy function then r and s they are interchangeable names oh sorry r and s are interchangeable or same names of one dictionary like i give one example to you you have one school name and your nickname for example we have himanshu himanshu's school name is himanshu but at home he is known by the name mickey ghar mein isko mickey bulate 
बट द पर्सन इज सेम हिमांशु कम हेयर मिक्की कम हेयर पर्सन इज द सेम इफ हिमांशु परचेज इज अ पेन इट मीन्स मिक्की परचेज इज अ पेन यस सो आई मेक वन चेंज हेयर आई प्रिंट आर आई प्रिंट एस I make one change in the R copy. City मैंने अपडेट किया City मैंने अपडेट कर दिया मुंबई R is the copy of S created via assignment operator. I try to update the city of the child from Delhi to Mumbai. in the r copy but obvious it will affect the s it will affect the s the original copy because both r and s are not separate copies they are same they are referencing to the same dictionary they are two different names for the same dictionary now print r city is mumbai now print s city is mumbai check it out you make any modifications in r parallel it will reflect the original one so using the assignment operator we are creating two names we are creating two labels for the same dictionary okay am i clear ye uski koi copy nahi hai ye wohi dictionary hai bas uska naam change kar diya right am i clear r is not copy of s rather dictionary s is referenced by another name r i hope i am able to clear myself to all yes 11th class all right now we have another case of copy when we are using the copy method using copy method okay i have s s dictionary i printed the s dictionary i say t equal to s dot copy here you check out what is the data type of values if data type of values is immutable changes done in t will not reflect original s dictionary ab maine t ko print karaya ye t print ho gaya maine t mein city change kar di i make changes in the city of t dictionary city ajmer now i print s dictionary city mumbai check it out if the value is of in values not key hum key ki baat nahi kar rahe we are talking of the values if the values are of 
immutable type then whatever changes you are doing in the copy of the dictionary will not reflect the original dictionary am i clear i uh, if values are immutable in nature then whatever changes we are doing in the copy of the dictionary will not affect the original dictionary am i clear to everyone what i have done yes 11th class हर नूर कौर कभी आपका फीडबैक तो कभी नहीं आता क्लास में मुझे ऑलवेज गिव अ डाउट टू मी वेदर यू आर इन द क्लास और यू आर नॉट इन द लेक्चर हर नूर कौर इलेवेंथ ए रोल नंबर सेवनटीन शी इज नॉट अटेंडिंग द क्लास अर्शदीप हरनूर इलेवेंथ बी रमनजीत याशिका मयंक Are you all here? Gur Sirat, Harsh Vardhan, Vritti, Anmol, Roll Number Five, Eleventh A. Kavya, Tarun, Mannat, Ashutosh, Kaliya, Mannat, Yuvraj Singh, Forty Four Roll Number, Samridhi, Pragati. आर्यमन अर्शप्रीत कौर रोल नंबर टू इलेवेंथ बी असीस इलेवेंथ ए अर्शप्रीत कौर रोल नंबर टू इलेवेंथ बी सेकेंड टाइम योर नेम हैज बीन अनाउंस्ड मंजोत इलेवेंथ बी दीक्षा इलेवेंथ बी अर्शप्रीत कौर इलेवेंथ बी शी इज नॉट देयर इन द क्लास हरनूर कौर इलेवेंथ ए शी इज ऑल्सो नॉट हेयर इन द क्लास All right. Now, second case. If values of dictionary are of mutable type, then changes done in the copy will definitely. effect the original i just prove it here i have a dictionary mai isme le raha hu roll number 1 comma 2 comma 3 see the value of the key is list and list is mutable okay value of the key is mutable right and uh, whenever we have the mutable type it will affect the original then i have marks now i have 30 comma 40 comma 50 again the marks key has value of list that is mutable type right now i created a dictionary b equal to a dot copy i print b dictionary now i make changes in the b dictionary b of roll number 
दिस की आई अपेंड द रोल नंबर फोर ये देखो बी ए डिक्शनरी में चेंजेस किए मैंने पहले तीन रोल नंबर थे नाउ आई हैव फोर रोल नंबर नाउ इफ आई प्रिंट हेयर ए डिक्शनरी चेक इट आउट हेयर दिस इज ए डिक्शनरी वट एवर चेंज यू मेक इन द बी द चेंज रिफ्लेक्ट इन द ए डिक्शनरी एम आई क्लियर टू ऑल वट एवर चेंजेस यू मेक इन द ए बी डिक्शनरी द चेंजेस रिफ्लेक्ट बैक इन द ओरिजिनल वाई दिस चेंज रिफ्लेक्ट बैक बिकॉज द वैल्यू ऑफ द की वॉज म्यूटेबल If the value is mutable, change will be reflected. If the value is <coughs> immutable, change will not be reflected. I hope the shallow copy lecture is clear to all. Am I clear? Is the shallow copy lecture thoroughly clear? All the variations in this. All right. Now I go with one practice question. ओके आई हैव वन डिक्शनरी विद द नेम ओल्ड नेम विनी एज ट्वेंटी फाइव ओके i have this dictionary then uh, i created one new dictionary by using the copy method okay i make changes in the copy by changing the name from vinny to tony print old what old will be printed who will tell what will be the content of old yes divanshi sir name vinny and age 25 name vinny age 25 okay if i print new riddhi Sir, name Tony or age twenty five. Name Tony, age twenty five. Okay. Why, when I print old, the name remains Vinny? Why not Tony? Who will tell? जब मैंने new print किया, तो new के अंदर मैंने name वाली key को update किया, Vinny से Tony किया. Tony get print, but when I print the original dictionary, it remains Vinny. Yes, Ashutosh. Sir, because uh, string is a immutable data type. Ah, value is ki immutable thi. Agar mutable hoti to changes ho jaate. Good, not bad. Okay, next question. Uh. i have dictionary old where i have this type name uh vinny comma rini okay and i have age field age key 25 and 30 i print old okay now i say new dot old dot copy oh sorry new equal to old dot copy i try to print old what old will be printed
Yes, Jatin. Sir, वो dictionary print हो जाएगी name Vinny Rini and age twenty five thirty. Okay. और अब अगर मैं चेंज करने की कोशिश करूं न्यू के अंदर मैंने नेम वाले में एक और नेम अपेंड कर दिया आदि आई प्रिंट न्यू तो ये चेंज आ गया न्यू में अब अगर मैं ओल्ड प्रिंट करूं तो क्या होगा यस yes, समृद्धि If I print old now, what change will come? So Vinny, Rini, Adi, Vinny, Rini, Adi. You want to say change reflect? Change will reflect the original. Yes, sir. Why? So because it is in mutable data type. It is mutable data type. Mutable data type. Clear? Now concept is clear to all about the shallow copy, and the questions are also clear. All right. Some question you want to ask? You have raised your hand. All right. Now moving to another method of dictionary. That is sorted method. Okay, I have dictionary A one B two B three C four F five E six. I print D over here. और ये मेरी डी डिक्शनरी प्रिंट हो गई ठीक है सॉर्टेड मेथड ऑफ डिक्शनरी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल ओनली सॉर्ट द कीज सॉर्टेड मेथड ओनली सॉर्ट द कीज ऑफ डिक्शनरी नॉट द वैल्यूज ओके वन इज दिस कॉन्सेप्ट सेकेंड कॉन्सेप्ट इज रिजल्ट ऑफ सॉर्टेड कीज इज डिस्प्लेड ऑलवेज इन द फॉर्म ऑफ लिस्ट ओके जैसे मैंने कहा ए इक्वल टू सॉर्टेड डी और ए को प्रिंट कराओ चेक करो ओनली Uh, first, so I was telling you about the sorted method. Sorted method only sort the keys of the dictionary in ascending or descending order. Okay, like uh, I have created a dictionary A. Okay, uh, sorry D. I created the dictionary D, and I try to sort the keys. by using the sorted method and i assign the sorted keys to a new variable b the variable b will print only the sorted keys in form of list check out if you want to show in the reverse order descending order reverse equal to true print c check it out am i clear do check the data type that what is the data type of the uh, sorted keys list form okay so the concept is the sorted method returns the sorted keys in list form okay clear 
now there are some variations which are used in the sorted method first variation is get the sorted list of keys from dictionary items okay like uh, i say uh a equal to sorted d dot keys keys function only print the keys and after doing them in sorted order we are assigning to the variable a now print variable a check it out check it out am i clear am i clear to all the result is same same result what you get from this no difference okay got it